Okay guys, so before this tutorial starts, I want you to check out RaymondDigital.com. It's basically a website where you can get like really awesome high quality intro templates that are really easy to edit. All the info is in the description down below. <laughs> What's happening guys, my name is Alex and welcome back to a brand new video and in this video guys, I'm going to show you guys how to render out your videos in 1080p and also 720p in Vegas 14. So I'm really stoked for the first tutorial in Vegas 14, so I would say, let's go. Okay guys, so you want to firstly select everything that you want to render out, but you're not going to render it out like immediately. You have to, you know, change some settings. When you selected your video and when you're done editing, you want to go to over to this little project video properties uh, button. This pops up, but it's nothing new, just like, just like Sony Vegas Pro 13. And basically I'm going to run over a few things that you guys need to do. So first of all, uh, the width has to be 1920. And second of all, the height has to be 1080. That's the standard resolution of 1080p. You can choose your frame rate. If you say like I'm sticking with 30 FPS, you can pick this one. You can pick 50 FPS, but I'm using 60 FPS or you can just fill in 60, doesn't matter. The pixel format, you wanna keep that on 8-bit. Uh, the view transform is not, you cannot you know change anything. The full resolution rendering quality, you wanna place this one from good to best. That's crucial. The motion tie blur is gosh. The interlace method is blend feels. Resample mode is disable resample. Adjust source media to better match project or render settings checked. And you can also see if you want to check this one, like start all new project with these settings. You want to click on apply and you want to click on OK. So now that we have done this, now it's time for the actual render part. We're going to over to file. You're really going to pick render as. Right here, it is really important what kind of format you're going to use. So usually I do is WMV, as you guys can see right here. But I'm going to change video format to Sony AVC MVC MP4 and you want to go over to I would say like internet 1920 by 1080 30p you want to click on customize template and right here you want to change also your frame rate 1920 by 1080 then you're going to play the profile you want to keep that on high then the frame rate also the same you can choose 30 uh, 50 or 60 I'm going to stick with 60 uh, and then everything you want to leave everything how, like how it is right here the audio is really important like include audio keep this one on AAC 48,000 128,000 and stereo that is actually crucial and then nothing right here in a system tab in a project tab you want to go over to video rendering quality you want to put that one to best stereoscopic 3d mode is just use project settings and the color space is default so now that we've done that we can save this so let's say I'm going to save this as YouTube 60 FPS 1080 what you can do is just click on this little diskette icon which saves your presets so you don't have to run over everything anytime you're going to render on a new video so I'm gonna click on OK and as you guys can see it appears in the list anytime you finished um, editing a video you can just pick the preset give it a name I'm just going to say I'm just gonna call this test you can choose right here the folder I'm just going to save it in my documents you want to click on this one and you want to click on render so right now it is rendering longer videos with like a uh, color correction uh, brightness and contrast effects everything will make the video heavier so the more effects you apply the longer it's going to take to render it just makes the project so much heavier with all the music the sound effects the, the effects applied to the video that is actually really important so now that we have done uh, this you can actually go ahead and do this in Sony Vegas 14 and if you say like Alex Can you make a video about it's like 720p? Uh, no, because this is just worse the same same idea Just change this one to 1280 by 720 choose your frame rate click on apply and click on ok click on render Render as you want to just go to this one Internet 1280 720p 30 also right here keep everything how it is just make sure you pick your frame rate I'm gonna place it on 60 you want to also include uh, audio as you guys can see keep it on like how it is then project which is just you know keep it on best keep it on use project settings default click on ok and now you also have a 720p preset so that's how simple this guys that's how you render out your video in 1080 and 720p it's really simple so that's how simple this that's how you render out a video in vegas 14 if you want to see more of those videos every wednesday uh, make sure to smash the like button down below thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys tomorrow so that's it for the video guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure to smash the like button down below and also subscribe button at the bottom so thank you for the continued support if you want to see more content make sure to click right here that's it for today thank you guys and i'll see you guys tomorrow